Looks like the compass is pointing right to that building. Oh, good. It only sounds like there are a few thousand big scary people between us and there. Halt! You there! What business have you? I, uh, think we need to go into that building behind you. If that's okay! Uh, you know, it is in fact not okay, okay? Now just move along and don't go anywhere near the building or we will sick our army on you. Or we'll sick our army on you. Wouldn't want to unleash the force of our army. And it's a mighty army. I fought creepers, zombies, a giant computer, a wither storm. Bring out your army. We can take it. You are not leaving. <laughs> you will regret not leaving after you've tasted the wrath of our mighty army. It's not weird. The army just, just, uh, took a power nap. Now they're stronger than ever. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks to their nap. Yeah. We're not going to ask you again, all right? You just skedaddle before our well-rested army makes you regret it. We're gearing up. Yeah, it's the biggest army you've ever heard right here. Nothing is scary about an army than it sound. Yeah. Please, please, please don't stick your army on us. Oh, please, please. We want to live. Listen, it's not a real army. It's just a jukebox recording, okay? Please, stop crying. We're not going to hurt you, but we can't let you in. Really, it's for your own good. That building you're pointing at... That's Romeo's challenge. Yeah, it's nothing more than a death trap. The worst kind of trap. Which is why we vowed to keep everyone out. Even relentless travelers like you. I mean, you should thank us for keeping you away from it, okay? We're doing you a solid. Yeah, duh. I escaped Romeo's highest security prison, the Sunshine Institute. Think I can handle some little challenge? Whoa. That's hardcore. Whoa, yeah. Anyone who escaped that place? Mad props. Open the gate! On it! No, Soup. The, the gate. Yeah, the, the real gate. Right! On it! Whoa, weird llama. You must smell Luna on you. This place is a wasteland. Yeah, uh, having a town where everyone enters a mysterious challenge room that never comes out will do that. I, uh, <laughs> suppose that, uh, might affect population levels a little. Yeah, we still don't feel good about permitting you in the challenge room, especially unarmed. But we'll trade you some gear if you can build something to scare off future unwanted visitors. You know, like a snowman or a huge flower. Just make something that will help us strike fear into the hearts of all who would see it. Keep people off our backs. Something to give us a little me time.
That will give me nightmares. <laughs> well done. Yes. Wonderfully horrifying. Organized, not alphabetized, not even sorted by material? This is barbaric! This is what we managed to salvage from the goofballs. Uh, I mean, residents who tried entering? Waterfalls upstairs. It's so calculated, so precise. Judging by the multiple pressure plates, there's some complex engineering behind these walls. I wouldn't expect anything less from the guy who made an icy palace of despair. I think this was meant for the three friends Romeo, Zara, and Fred. How do you guys feel about pulling some mystery levers and seeing what happens?
crafting table nearby. <laughs> this guy has a twisted way of playing with his friends. Maybe we can bring this one down with water, too. Radar and I will be the base. We're fine. and get out of here. Remember I used to read all the time? Now I barely do. Things change. Yeah. 
It's like the one we used to have back at the treehouse. Tell someone you broke it. Uh huh. <sighs> Petra, what's wrong? Uh, n nothing. It just reminds me of uh, this this story about puppies. Really sad story. You know me, I can't help crying about dumb stuff like that. Puppies, little chickens. Come on, Petra, you're lying. We both know it. No! Puppies just make me really sad, okay? <sighs> Fine. It it's not the puppies. Doesn't this remind you of anything? Our friends? We used to hang out in that treehouse all the time. Now, we barely talk. Why does this keep happening? Everyone leaves and I'm, I'm just by myself again. I, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I see them one by one just leaving. I kind of thought you liked it that way. You've always had this I don't need anybody thing going on. I know, I, I just thought I could convince myself, I guess. Axel and Olivia are barely around. We already lost Jack. Didn't take long for the new Order of the Stone to fall apart, did it? My fault for thinking it would be different. Held together longer than most. That doesn't make it hurt any less, though. Just because we have our own lives doesn't mean we aren't friends. We still care about each other. They'd be here if they cared. I, I know this isn't important right now. Let's just find the weapon and get out of here. Something's not right here. The beds don't go with the banners? not important. We have bigger things to worry about right now. I get that. If it's important to you, then it's important to me. I'm okay. Really. We have to take down the admin. After that, we'll figure out what comes next. I don't care how silly it sounds, as long as it works. Yeah, I guess. Just... Potato? 
or sorry, I meant hashtag potato 451. Take this word of passage and use it at the primary terminal. You can take away his power and end this. Word of passage, huh? I guess that's the potato. I still have hope for Romeo. He just wanted us to stay together more than anything. I know that's why he's doing this. Maybe I'm being foolish, but I need to know for sure before taking this step. Though I guess if you're here, I got my answer. Maybe someday we'll be together again. Your friend always, Fred. I kind of feel bad for them. Don't you? Yeah, I feel kind of bad for them too. This wasn't easy for any of the admins. They really cared about each other. Everyone talks about Romeo like he was this controlling monster, but Fred wrote that Romeo just wanted to keep them together more than anything. Isn't that what I've been doing? Especially to you? I don't want you to feel forced to keep doing something you don't want to. I don't want to be that person. Or, or make you feel scared to tell me the truth. You are nothing like the admin. Don't compare yourself to him. Even he didn't start out that way. It just got bad. I don't want to cross that line too. I've been thinking a lot about what you said. About how friendship is my thing. But I don't think I can just stay put, you know? In Beacon Town. But I don't want to lose you. You mean a lot to me, Jesse. I... More than anyone else, you've been there. And I... I don't want to leave if it means... I'll be right there with you, Petra. If you think your place is out there, then so is mine. Thank you. I always knew you were a big old softy. <laughs> You'll never be able to prove it. We'll see. We'd better get that book back to the portal. Right. Let's go stop the admin. His days of being Jesse are over. did it. This is it then! It's time to call the others. We're getting out of here. What do you think you're doing? The portal is hidden for a reason. To keep things away. We're still missing Nurm. Great. That won't be a burden. Sounding pretty adminish there, Zara. The weapon is what we need, not bodies to throw at the problem. People just complicate things. Make everything messy. Inefficient. No one, no one gets left behind, ever. I mean, that's not exactly true. Yes, that furry one. The weird horse. You left her in the prison. But we we needed... Well, from now on, then. Might be your downfall, waiting on others. Better be careful about that. As you can see, the portal's fully functional. You complete your end? Yep, I think this should send us home. And there's Fred's weapon. Potato. Weird, right? I, I thought it was weird. Fred trusted him. He went to Romeo with the best of intentions and was... was... Ugh. There is no redemption in Romeo. None. He needs to be stopped. Once and for all. 
He deserves it. Worse. For this and everything else. It's the only way. You know that's not what Fred would have wanted. No, you're right. But Fred is dead because of his heart. Something else has to be tried. But heroes are supposed to help people, not hurt them. Romeo deserves what's coming to him. Fred should be avenged. Fred was the best of us, cut down. I can't let it stand. Going after revenge would make us just like Romeo, Zara. We're better than that. Yeah. Well, I guess we'll have to see if Romeo understands anything but violence. Romeo destroyed my world, and I wasn't there to help it. He's stolen it from me. There is no rebuilding. I have nothing now. It's really over. All the things we made. Here, I found this, and there are good things left if you look for them. That you would... I... I'm not used to being wrong. Thank you. But we still need to move forward. <sighs> All right. Let's get this over with. Hand over that trinket of yours. Uh, Jesse?
Enderman is never gonna leave us alone. portals ever what nerm said that was not a quality three-point landing sorry nermy is everyone all right it's the old order's temple we did it we're back <laughs> Radar would be flipping out if he were here right now. Standing where the great hero stood, this is amazing! Spot on impression. I mean, come on. You know he'd be all over historical Order of the Stone sites. Yeah, this place would have blown his mind. Will, when he sees it. Jesse, we are... Endlessly grateful to your friend for what he did for us. We'd thank him if we could. We didn't know if we'd ever see the sky again. Did you see that? Okay, somebody tell me I'm losing it. Jesse, 
is it good to see you? Where are the others? 